Turning now to our forecast, a live look over campus marshes there. And good news, you still have this weekend and next weekend to hit the ice rink. We're in for some sunshine and also lighter winds, which are going to come as a welcome change, Hallie. That's right. And, you know, you get out in the morning and it feels, yeah, it's going to feel cold. Temperatures are in the 20s. But by the afternoon with the sunshine and temperatures near or even above 50, it's going to feel decent, too, as you get out and enjoy the outdoors this afternoon. Don't forget, daylight saving time does begin and it begins tonight. So before you hit the bed, just make sure you put those clocks ahead one hour. Officially, it's at 2 a.m. in the morning, but we are tracking a wintry mix. So that is not going to come until Monday. So we get through a really nice weekend. I want to talk about daylight saving time and how it affects you. Sunrise this morning, 648 tomorrow morning morning sunrises at 7 46 and then we look at sunset times at 6 38 tonight and then tomorrow night it's at 7 39 so we kind of suffer that loss of an hour of sleep but at least we get to keep that daylight going longer in the evening starting tomorrow so that'll be nice 15 degrees in ann arbor not so nice this morning it is a cold one 18 degrees in Howell, also in lapeer you're 26 degrees downtown so temperatures down about 10 to 15 at least degrees from yesterday at this time. Light winds this morning, even calm in some cases. By the time we hit the afternoon between 2 and 5 o'clock, so the afternoon hours, it is going to be a bit breezy. Looking at gusts up to 20 miles per hour, not as strong as we've had the past several days, but still a little bit of a breeze into the afternoon. Temperatures today, 50 by 3 o'clock, low 50s through the afternoon with that breeze, upper 40s by 6 o'clock, and still nice and dry. Little change tomorrow. Tomorrow there's a north wind, so maybe shedding a, a couple of degrees, so kind of taking that off of the high temperature tomorrow, so more of the upper 40s than low 50s. But tracking the wintering mix coming in Monday, and it looks like the timing is going to play a huge role, of course, on whether this comes in as snow or maybe a rain snow mix. So we go through today, no issues at all weather wise. Tomorrow, more of the same. I think tomorrow night we'll see more high clouds. Certainly, we'll see clouds thicken up on Monday. This is actually six o'clock in the evening. So, right now, the timing, and we're going to work with this timing the rest of today. Mike Taylor's on tonight. Of course, he'll let you know too. And then tomorrow, but it does look like it could be coming in during the evening drive on Monday. And the onset, more of a snow, possibly a rain-snow mix, and then bouncing back and forth Monday night into early Tuesday as the system comes through. And it does look like it'll move out in time for Tuesday. Maybe not the morning rush hour, but the evening looks decent. So we'll continue to watch that for you as the system unfolds for the start of the week. Now, temperature today, 52 degrees. We always like you to kind of put things in perspective with our highs. Our high average is 44 degrees, and our winds are west-southwest, picking up 5 to 15 miles per hour and then tonight mostly clear but not as cold 34 for a low so at least we're above freezing 49 degrees tomorrow and then upper 30s you can see how things are a little complicated with more of a rain snow mix late monday into early tuesday